The following segment is sponsored by doTERRA. We all know doTERRA for their amazing essential oil products, but did you know there is an entire scientific team behind each one? Well, Nicole is here and she's gonna tell us what she does for doTERRA and about her team of scientists. Nicole, thanks for joining us today. This is so fun. So I am the director of clinical research here at doTERRA and I'm just one of many scientists that doTERRA has on staff. I mean, we've got scientists for research and development and for quality and for other kinds of, re we've got scientists everywhere. doTERRA really is a scientist company and we are excited to be able to bring some validation to essential oil science. Well and that's why you have such amazing products because I imagine it takes months even years maybe for something to be finalized. Yes usually years because we've got to make sure we've got the supply chain in, in place and we've yeah. got everything ready before we release an essential oil. Absolutely okay and I know you're a mom yes. our kids are back in school and may, we might have science projects that are coming up that we need to do. Do you have any ideas for us? Oh gosh this is where I nerd out as my kids know so <laughs> I love science fair and parents you don't need to be too intimidated because there are lots of great ideas that are really simple to do for a science fair project. I'm going to show you one today. Okay, yay. This is to do with surface tension. So the idea that molecules can sometimes stick together at the surface of a, a liquid, like a water skeeter, would okay. walk on water. Yeah. Kind of like that same idea. We're going to demonstrate that using a penny, something hopefully everyone's got in their house. Very cool. And we're basically going to take drops of water and put them on the penny count the number of drops. So the more surface tension a liquid has, the more drops we'll be able to pile on that penny and you'll see, see what happens. Okay. okay. So I'm gonna start with the water. We're gonna drop it on the penny and we're gonna count. Okay, Ready? here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, you count for me. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, oh. 36, 37, 38. Oh, there That's we go. That's a lot of drops <laughs> of water. Of drops. Lots of surface tension that in that. That was so cool to water. see how it just bubbles. Yeah. And you can, I mean, you can do that time and again. These pennies, of course, reusable. Let's try a different liquid. Okay. okay. How does another a different liquid behave with their surface tension? Different molecules. Mm. Okay. So that's the question. That's your okay. scientific question, your okay. hypothesis. What do you think is going to happen? I, I'm going to say about, let's go 20. Two. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 20, 21, 22, 23. Oh, we're about good 22. job. So okay. close. Different surface tension, different liquids. You can test any liquid you want. That's the fun of this experiment. You get your kids, they say, Mom, I want to test apple juice or yeah. orange juice or milk. I mean, different surface tensions are going to give you different results on your penny. Just write, write it down. That's write the one thing you're going to forget. You're gonna <laughs> you won't. Great science fair project, super easy, lots of fun for kids. So parents, get involved. It's yeah. really fun. Well, this is great for kids even younger. Yes. Because my four-year-old would oh, absolutely yes. love this. Yes. Okay, and I, I love too that you guys are part, you're a STEM partner with us. Very doTERRA much. is at KUTV. Now, where can we go for more information? doTERRA.com has some amazing resources. Go and search. They've got blogs and kids' activities. They've got all kinds of information about the oil. Source to you.com has lots of information too about our sourcing and our, the plants that go into the oils. Those two sites are some of my favorite. Amazing. I love those. High five for science. Yeah. Love it, Nicole. Thank you for showing us that. Thank you.